the Capricorn male or Capricorn man personality. Let's talk about it. I'm Lamar Townsend. I'm a natural intuitive, clairvoyant, clairaudient, psychic tarot reader, as well as an astrologist. And I would love to do a birth chart reading for you or a psychic tarot reading for you or a love sinistry combat- compatibility birth chart reading. So if you would like any of those things, please contact me on my website, lamartownsendtarot.com for that information to purchase your own reading. Um, You can purchase it directly from my website or email me at lamar.townsend at gmail.com. Also, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button so that you get a notification whenever I upload a new video. I would also love it if you would follow me on Instagram at Lamar Townsend and like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash Lamar Townsend official. Thank you for listening and watching. The Capricorn male personality. Well, for one, Capricorn males tend to be very responsible uh, individuals. Um, Capricorn is ruled by Saturn, and Saturn is a very responsible planet, very serious planet. Um, It rules the past, it rules time, it rules debt, it rules karma. It also rules work ethic um, and things of that nature. You know, Capricorn males tend to make good managers. They tend to make good uh, people who manage others (laughs) because this is something that Capricorns, um, you know, do to do do on a day to day basis for the most part, especially Capricorn males. Um, You know, Capricorn man or male, you know, um, will will be the the one in the group of friends who is kind of keeping everyone on track, keeping everyone level headed, keeping everyone focused on what's important. Right. Capricorn male in a relationship is the one who is once again responsible, the one who uh, is going to make sure that, you know, the bills paid, you know, for dinner, you know, that the bills are paid in general, that, you know, um, they're going to show love by uh, doing things for you. You know, Capricorns are ruled by Saturn. They're not ruled by some frilly, you know, lovey-dovey planet like Venus, unfortunately. Um, but fortunately, because, you know, we all have our, our strengths and weaknesses, right? But Capricorn is ruled by Saturn. So Capricorns are very serious people. They're not always serious, but they are very serious people when it comes to doing, when it comes to being on time and being disciplined and self-controlled, right? Um, you know, Capricorn males are super duper self-controlled. Um, so they can be hard to read, um, which makes people so frustrated and so angered sometimes because, you know, a lot, a lot of times people don't understand what's going through a Capricorn man's or a Capricorn male's mind. You know, it doesn't matter what age they are. People are constantly trying to figure out, trying to guess what's going through Capricorn's mind. What is he thinking about right now? You know, and the most, for the most part, you know, nine times out of 10 people can't get it right. You know, sometimes they can be thinking of something so simple as what they're going to eat you know for lunch sometimes they're thinking of something more complex like where do they see themselves 10 years from now it really depends you know and it could you know they could have that one thought then one minute and the next thought you know the next minute you know capricorns can be worriers so um capricorn males definitely can be um a little bit arrogant all right a little bit uh know-it-alls um, they're super duper smart, very intelligent, you know, um, you know, Saturn, uh, is rules the psychological mind as well. Um, remember, you know, the psychological mind does deal with routine. It does deal with, um, you know, prioritizing things and prioritize, prioritizing what's most, most important, you know, and this is kind of where that Capricorn arrogance, you know, coldness comes from. They are just really good at prioritizing what's important for them what's important to them i think a lot of people also get their feelings um you know caught up in that as well because you know a lot of times you know people come second in a capricorn man's life you know uh, for a capricorn work often comes first school comes first family comes first you know other people often you know um uh you know sometimes even you know um family comes second you know uh partners come second and that's just how it has to be sometimes because a capricorn man at the end of the day is remember responsible disciplined you know they're they're gonna put in uh overtime at work just so they can get a nice paycheck so they can do nice things so that they can have money in the bank so that 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 just that's security for a capricorn money in the bank being able to buy things that they want being able to 
buy things that they need when they need it that's security for a capricorn whereas for example a cancer man like security for a cancer man definitely deals with financial security but emotional security as well um there is no emotional security for a capricorn if there's no financial security if there's no literal security like a home or something like that there's no just no emotional security for a capricorn if they don't have that right um, you know, Capricorn men like family, they love family, even though sometimes they aren't um, always there, you know, uh, with their family, because they're such hard workers a lot of the times, you know, a lot of times Capricorns can also isolate themselves, um, especially when they're dealing with something tough, when they're kind of having a... <clears throat> excuse me when they're like having like a tough a moment in their life they can definitely isolate themselves and you know that's a self-protective mechanism for a capricorn a capricorn doesn't like to bombard other people with their problems because in a capricorn's mind their problems are huge their problems are humongous especially a capricorn man's mind and you know no one would be able to handle the problems of a capricorn but a capricorn especially a capricorn man right at least in their mind right in their mind um this is um not always the best thing because a lot of times people want to be there for Capricorn, especially Capricorn men. But Capricorn men are such strong individuals, such strong souls um, that a lot of times they think they can just carry the burden or the burdens themselves. And, you know, it, it takes a while for them to learn that you don't have to carry the burden yourself, Capricorn. People want to help you. People want to um, see you succeed and they want to see you succeed in a peaceful and a non-stressful way. They don't want to see you suffer. So... But in a Capricorn man's mind, sometimes suffering um, it can be a good thing. Suffering creates character. Suffering creates more strength in a Capricorn man's mind, right? So it's really um, a balance with them. Um, you know, they love family. They like tradition. They're very traditionalist Capricorn uh, men. Even though sometimes they balk at tradition because they get so bored by the, the mundaneness of it all and the, you know, the, the same thing time and time again, you know, over and over. Sometimes they can be Scrooges in that way. But, you know, the interesting thing about that is that at the end of the day, they just... They really want love. They really, you know, Capricorns have difficulty sometimes expressing their emotions, their true emotions. So they can sometimes um, express it in more passive, aggressive, I guess, non-direct ways. Um, or they'll just, you know, ignore it and work work it away. Uh, but, of course, you can't do that. Um, you know, Capricorn men often don't like... Um, to be seen or heard um a lot of times they like to, to kind of do their own thing they like to you know hide under the radar um but when you do hear or see them trust that you know capricorn a capricorn man is is typically a looker they have that silent strong strength to them um that tends to uh make the uh either the opposite sex or the same sex wild sometimes it's both sexes um <laughs> Uh, but you know, Capricorn knows what they want. So even if they do get hit on by both sexes, which I'm a Capricorn and I get hit on by both sexes, but I'm gay. So I know what I want. I know what I, I want a man. I want a man who, you know, is this and that like Capricorns or the Capricorn men are those types of people. So even though they have people constantly hitting on them, Capricorns have good filters. So, you know, if you don't fit the, the, the what they want, you're not going to get far with a Capricorn, no matter how much you try to seduce, no matter how much you try to, you know, win them over. You, you can't win a Capricorn man over if he doesn't want to be kept by you, you know, as hard as that is to say. You know what I'm saying? Capricorn men know what they want. A Capricorn male know what it, knows what he wants, even when he's a kid. Um, and a lot of times they will push the things that they don't want away, um, even when sometimes it's it's actually good for them. You know, it's, it's a good thing for them. It may not be exactly what they want, but... Um, it can still be a good thing for them, but Capricorn is super stubborn, you know, especially Capricorn men, very stubborn. Capricorn men, women can be stubborn in this way too, you know, even if it, if it's not what they want, want to down to the T or almost to the T, then then Capricorn just doesn't want it, you know, and that's just how they can be, very stubborn, very know it all, um, but you know that's what attracts people to them, um, you know, they're very uh, ambitious and persistent you know and um you can't keep a capricorn man down you know even when he's down so 
That is the personality of a Capricorn man in a nutshell. I hope you enjoyed this little short video. Watch the rest of my Capricorn videos if you would like more information on Capricorns. Uh, also, you can contact me for your own personal private reading um, or, or consultation if you are having trouble with a Capricorn. Maybe you need a tarot reading or maybe a love compatibility synastry chart reading. would Birth chart reading would be good for you. So um, contact me on my website, lamartownsendtarot.com or email me at lamar.townsend at gmail.com. Subscribe. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button. Keep in contact on Facebook at Lamar Town or Lamar Townsend Official, Facebook.com slash Lamar Townsend Official, and on Instagram at Lamar Townsend, okay? Adios. Namaste.